them and over 59 pressure cooking recipes. You'll get them all for under $20. This is sold out both days it's been on. And how many are already gone, Sean? 400 are gone. Howard Rosenthal, who is in charge of the test kitchens of Mr. Food, is here today. Good to have you back, sir. Great being here. Nice to see you. Nice chilly day. I this had type of food. the great pleasure of visiting your test kitchens back in the fall. It was fun. And had a chance to really sample and see some of the great recipes that were used in this book. This is an amazing collection of great recipes. We had such a great time building it because so many people get a pressure cooker, a slow cooker, whether they get it here, they had it for 100 right. years. And they get that little book that has 10 recipes in it. But sure. what do you do after that? So we really want to empower people with these great recipes. They're all quick, easy, off-the-shelf ingredients is what we're known for. Gorgeous color photos, easy to follow instructions. Whether you have a stovetop, digital, or even a microwave pressure cooker, you're going to find information inside on how to work with these recipes. But they are so easy to work with. The steps are simple, the color photographs are gorgeous, and more importantly, the food is out of this world. It is. You know, you mentioned whether you have a microwave, a stovetop, or an electric, we actually have the recipes for a regular uh, pressure cooker, and then we break it down so if you have whatever brand electric pressure cooker you have, it makes it easy to understand, and that's so important. Well, absolutely, and I will tell you that we are very busy on our phone lines, and we do not have a lot to go around in what can ship immediately. The, we will then go to an advanced order, but I must tell you this is the last day at this featured price, Howard. That How means at the end of the day today, this price goes away for good. How about a little shortcut chicken and dumplings? Oh, how about some shortcut chicken and dumplings? Why don't we start there? These are done in a slow cooker, yes sir? They are. Okay. Nice and warm. You just come home, you have your house smelling amazing. Oh. The dumplings are... Pillowy and fantastic. They are. They're nice and light. We start with refrigerated, uh, frozen vegetables, which makes it so much easier. Uh -huh. We don't have time. Mm. Nice and easy. Mm-hmm. Isn't that nice? Mm-hmm. Would you hold this, please? Oh, my gracious. Thank you. I was hoping you might. Happy dance! That's a chicken and dumpling happy dance. Mmm. Mmm. Slow cooker, which means they're going to simmer and be gorgeous all, all day long. All the flavor goes through everything. The, pil the, the pillowy soft dumplings, the savory velvety chicken gravy, the tender pieces of white and dark meat chicken, those plump tender vegetables. Is there anything nicer on a cold day than chicken and dumplings that's in the book? What's next? How about if we go to a pressure cooker? Well, there's a big game coming up, a big football game right. coming up. Big game in Buffalo February. Buffalo chicken meatballs. Four minutes in a pressure cooker. Oh, wow. Four minutes. You take that, you dunk it in a little bit of blue cheese dressing. A little blue cheese dressing. And you are set to go. Mm. Mm. Oh, Howard, these are outstanding. All right. They're nice and light. So that, good. The flavor goes through and through, which is, mm. you don't get that if you're cooking mm -hmm. on the stovetop. Oh, my goodness. What's next? Do we like ribs? Pressure cooker ribs. Raspberry barbecue ribs. Mm -hmm. Fall apart tender. Look at this. Comes right off the bone. 30 minutes and you have the best. The meat, I'm just using my fingers, but that's the best way to show it. Just wow. comes right off. 1,500 of these are now gone. Howard, we're very, very busy. And that raspberry glaze can is just amazing. Can we talk about cowboy beef brisket? This we is sure made in can. the pressure cooker. How quickly? In 25 minutes, wow. you have a tender as can be brisket. Okay. Instead of cooking it for two to three hours on your stovetop, let me just slice this here. Look at that, beautiful. And then we have a little bit of a cowboy gravy to go over oh, it. Oh, nothing about that makes me mad. Come on, let's get it. Woo! Right, Mary? Mmm. Nice and tender. Get and it right on up. And we mm. can serve that over garlic smashed potatoes. Mm-hmm. Five minutes in the pressure cooker. Wow. How Quick as a wink beef stew. But uh, 2,000 books are gone now. And this is another hearty dish for a cold, cold, snowy day, right? Absolutely. Beef stew, chunks of beef, potato, carrot, very traditional with some unique flavors in the spices. Just try that. Let me Ooh, get let you me, a... Here, I'll grab this one right here. You got one? Okay, yeah, good. And again, the meat is so tender, it probably falls apart as it's you're... It's hard to even get on the fork. Wow. And this is so... Mm. 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. 20 minutes, this is done. So you come home, you throw this on, you open the mail, dinner's ready. Make a salad. Oh, my word. So perfect. Imagine waking up to slow cooker Eggs Benedict. Everything you love about Eggs Benedict, the English muffin, the, <clears throat> the ham, the eggs, delicious. And then we put a little hollandaise sauce over this. Oh, and you know what we have to talk about, because I know our Mary has already snarfed a piece, is the chocolate peanut butter cake. Oh, the gluten-free one. Yes. So this is made in a slow cooker. Okay. And then we just fill it with a quick peanut butter frosting. 
and it is to die for. Oh my God. It, it happens so to have good. peanut butter cups uh -huh. in it and on uh -huh. top of it. Mm hmm. Oh, stop. No, Just Marin. the piece that you grabbed. Oh. <laughs> That's the only thing missing from this one. Mary Hollard, is it missing anything? And Howard said, just the piece you took. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my. How is it delicious? And over here, donut bread pudding. So if you like, what? it's sort of like French toasty bread pudding, pressure cooker, 15 minutes starting with glazed donuts. So we take glazed donuts, we cut them up, we toss them some eggs and raisin and cinnamon, put it in a pressure cooker, 15 minutes, and that's what you have. Wow. Is that nice? Okay, so here's the story. We have 4,500 books left that we can ship immediately. Okay. All right, we've already taken orders for 3,000 books. I have 4,500 left. This price goes away end of day today. When those 4,500 books are gone, and it looks like that's gonna happen pretty quickly, we're gonna move to an advanced order of January the 29th. All right. You'll have to wait another 10 days or so to get yours. Please go ahead and uh, dial in for it now so you're insured to get yours shipped immediately. How about an all-in-one lasagna soup? This is done in the slow cooker. We're getting this, a nice shot of that. Look at this, this is kind of deconstructed lasagna. It is, it's the sausage and the noodles and the uh, sauce. Put that in here, and what we're gonna do let me just put a little more of that. If you hold that for of a course, second. Of course, of course. And we're gonna put a little bit of ricotta on top. Of course. And a little bit of parsley. Parsley. And you just try that. Nice. It's so nice, it just simmers and the noodles. It's, you know, when you make lasagna, it's a whole day project. But this way, you put everything oh, in, you break man. it up, and it tastes like it. This is just perfect. It's lasagna soup. You've got a brothy tomato, a tomato broth, and then you've got noodles and sausage and the herbs and all the cheese. It just oh all my comes word. together so nicely. I'd hit that with some Parmesan cheese and that would be all right. Serve that with some garlic toast, oh my word. And here's risotto. If you've ever made risotto, it's a, you have to stand there and babysit and keep stirring it. Mm -hmm. Nine minutes in a pressure cooker and it's all done. You just walk away, it comes back and it is so creamy and rich, it's just amazing. You can do it with mushrooms, you can put meat in it, Really, whatever you choose. The soup is fantastic. Isn't that nice? Risotto is so good. Hey, let's also talk about some of the other things. Cookies and cream on the far end? Yes. Talk to us about this. This is cookies and cream cheesecake. I think cheesecakes come out amazing in a slow cooker because it's in a hot water bath. Mm -hmm. This way, they don't crack on top. They're so creamy throughout. Let me just grab a fork here. here. Oh, here's you have a piece one. for Excellent. you. All right. Ooh, and you can just see. Cookies and cream cheesecake, okay. Mmm. It's just so creamy. Oh my God. And the Oreo. Howard. It's the sandwich cookies inside. I, 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 mm mm. mm, -mm. Y'all just need to stop for a minute. Let me eat some more. If, we're both, mm. if we both have mouthfuls, then you'll be very quiet on everything. Oh my goodness. Howard, that's outstanding. Macaroni and cheese. We can't do a book without mac and cheese. Well, okay, let's do that. All right, here we go. I've heard you like it. Pressure cooker. This is done in a microwavable pressure cooker. Two minutes. Look how creamy this Two is. Two minutes. Wow. Try that. It's got cream cheese. Now, before I take a bite here, I do have a quick update. We started with 7,500 books to get ship out now. I have 2,300 left, and we've got a lot of people on the phone lines. This is pressure cooker mac and cheese. Remember, the book is going to have 100 slow cooker recipes, 59 pressure cooking recipes, but this is two minute mac and cheese. Here we go. Is it nice and creamy? Did I disappoint? <laughs> Happy dance, Mary, the second one. Happy dance. <laughs> that is a winter snowy day. Happy dance. This is outstanding, Howard. Oh my gosh, this is so good. And one thing we're really proud of is that every recipe is on one page, has a photo, and on the top there's a little indication here whether it's done in a slow cooker or a pressure cooker. So you know right away. Right away. There's which no, recipe it there's is. There's no guesswork. This one has pressure cooker. So it makes it really nice, step-by-step -step instructions. And beautiful color photos. We're gonna go to, uh, I have 1,500 left now that can ship out immediately out of the 7,500 we brought in. I have 1,400 people on the phone lines. We will get to an advanced order quantity in this presentation. If you want your shipping now, now's the time to be on the phone line and you don't wanna wait on these recipes. Let's welcome Debbie in Hi, New Debbie. York. Debbie, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Well, Debbie, after the uh, all-in-one lasagna soup, the, the chicken and dumplings, the macaroni and cheese, the, ch uh, the cookies and cream cheesecake, you're going to love this book. I know. It's going to come in handy during the week. I work a lot. Oh, this is perfect I tell for you that. what, slow cookers and pressure cookers become a busy cook's best friend. 
because I always say the slow cooker does the heavy lifting while you're living the rest of your life and doing other things, and the pressure cooker just gets it done in a hurry when you get home and you've got to get a good meal on the table quickly. That's true. Well, what looked good to you on the table, Miss Debbie? The chicken and dumplings, oh. one of my favorites. I tell you what, now Debbie, you're from New York. I don't know if you are from the South. I am. Chicken and dumplings is one of my all-time favorite comfort foods. My grandmother used to make it from scratch, and I would sit and uh, watch her. And then as I grew older, I still stood and watched her, and then we would sit down and eat them together. It's just something so special and so comforting. Yes, that my grandma had a recipe that you couldn't follow because she just did a pinch of this, a pinch of that, and there was no measuring. Oh, exactly. This will make it so easy for you. You know what? That's an old-fashioned term called dump cooking, where they would just kind of grab and cook by feel. And, mm -hmm. um, and so it's so nice that these recipes are now all compiled for us, and you can enjoy these. And I hope you will enjoy all the great recipes inside. Thank you. You're welcome. Great to talk to you, Debbie. Stay warm today, okay? You too. Thank you very much. These, Thanks, love. These smothered pork chops are unbelievable. They are so tender in a slow cooker. one of cooker. my faves, yeah. Hey, let me update everyone. We have sold out of everything that we can ship today. So we're now into an advanced order date of January 29th. You're only going to wait another 10 days, right, we're going to have this right on away. your doorstep. Let me show you real quickly the inside of the book. Howard was just showing you that the top of every recipe is tabbed, whether it's slow cooker or pressure cooker. But let me update you on something real quickly. We've just taken over 7,600 orders that could ship today. I have 4,000 left in the advanced order. So. If history bears us out on this, those 4,000 are going to go very quickly, and you'll have to wait another 10 days to get them. Look what's inside. Gorgeous color photos. Every recipe is only on one page, and we know how important that is for you. Oh, my gosh. Is that? Hello. Cal uh, North Carolina corn pudding. Yeah, I'm familiar with that. Oh, my gosh. Look at all these great, great recipes, all the wonderful color photos. Easy as pie. One, two, three, four steps. It's just so simple, and every single recipe is so simple, so delicious, and so perfect for either the slow cooker or the pressure cooker to help you cook it slow and then cook it fast. David, now, this is great for Mother's Day. So if you're thinking oh of, you know, like, maybe thinking I got ahead. a pressure sure, sure. cooker or a slow cooker for the holidays, surprise mom with one of these. What well, nice I'll tell you now, we've taken a grand total of 8,500 orders. We have 3,000 left that can ship out on January the 29th. And I have 1,800 people on the phone lines. Wow, Mr. Race, Howard, race our to very the best to you, you and all the Pleasure. folks at the Test Kitchen. Want to thank you for being here and safe travels home, my friend. Thank you. I know you're looking forward to getting back to that warmth in Florida. Uh, this is F11886. Let's check in with Mary, who's going to update us on what else is coming up today. Thank you, David. And uh, I tell you what should be coming up is a little bit more of that cake from Mr. Food. It is so good, you guys. Well, don't go anywhere because at 3 p.m. Eastern time, you get another full hour with David Venable with Dyson Cleaning. We're going to take a look at our today's special value during that hour. And then 4 p.m. Eastern time, we're going to have an hour of Serta. And then 5 p.m. Eastern time, Clark's Footwear here at QVC. On QVC.com, winter weekends, don't go outside.